How's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel. Again, my name is Marco. Thank you for tuning in. So once again, we're out here at the river. We're fishing in Northern Illinois and we're actually targeting the afternoon bite. Today is Sunday, November 19th. It is about 47 degrees right now. So temperatures should actually continue to rise up, which is insane. I mean, it's almost Thanksgiving and I think the highest today should be like 57, 58. I was actually out here last week and the bite was super tough. I ended the day just with two bass. Overall, didn't have a decent day, but hopefully today's a little bit different. Now, since the bite was pretty tough last week, I figured I'm gonna bring the entire arsenal. So I've got five rods today. I don't know if we'll use all of them, we'll see, but essentially we're throwing jerk baits, we're throwing spinner baits, flipping jigs, uh, a ball head jig with a Kitex swim bait. All right guys, so sit back, relax, get a cup of coffee. I'll check in with you guys midday. Oh, I knew I pedal drive in the water first. I need to get a cup of coffee. I actually have a really strong addiction to coffee, if I'm being honest. I think I average like five or six cups a day, which is probably not a good thing. Not for anyone. This coffee should be pretty warm. Again, it's not terribly cold, but Cheers. So yeah, guys, like I mentioned, we're gonna throw the entire arsenal today. Uh, just really try a little bit of everything just to see what bites, what sticks, what do these bass want? I mean, I don't think most of these bass are in shallow areas anymore. I should still be able to find a couple though, but I think they're probably starting to move a little bit deeper into the water. By the way, if you're ever curious, the whole SL bassing thing SL bassin essentially just means smallmouth, largemouth bass. Yeah, I mean, that's my, those are my two favorite species of fish to target. So that's what my fish finder looks like right now. So again, it just flickers and then it eventually goes dark. Um, yeah, this is my dad's unit and I wanted to test his out, but the same thing's happening. So it must be something with the transducer or the power cable. Let me know if you guys have seen this or uh, if you have any suggestions on how to fix this. Using this rock to stay stationary. I think today might be another grind, guys. Last week was pretty tough, and today's probably gonna be a little bit uh, of the same. But that's all right, right? It's called fishing, not, uh, not catching. Not a lot of action today, guys, so I need another <laughs> coffee break. Oh man, what a tough bite. I've literally thrown everything today. We threw the spinner bait, we threw crankbait, uh, a big swim bait, the smaller swim bait with the jig head, flipping a jig, jerk bait. That's everything. That's everything that I have for my fall tackle box. So I don't know. They're just not cooperating today. a little one. Just a little smally. All right, buddy, give me a sec. Man, you are cold. Well, that's the first one, guys. Not the size we're looking for, but still feels pretty cool to actually put one on the kayak. So just a really small, small mouth here. See you, buddy. I'm hoping that means the bite picks up because it's been a really slow day.
Man, that took a while. Number two. Number two for today. Really cold bass. All right, hopefully this is a good sign in the first of many more. That felt really good though. That was a really good bite. Really aggressive bite. Trying to hurry up to get it back in there. I actually had just made a quick switch on the flipping jig, throwing something a little bit darker in color. It's like a green pumpkin and blue. So I'm gonna kind of just change the technique a little bit. And so instead of covering or targeting this deeper water, we'll go ahead and fish shallow now. And again, just targeting these areas where you've got timber, lay down, brush. Uh, typically that's where I have most of the success fishing in the river, so. So by the way, if you're curious, I'm actually throwing a Dobbin 7.3. Yeah, medium, heavy, fast action on 15 pound fluorocarbon. But this is a really solid rod. This is the, uh, the utility rod. And I actually got this guy last year when they went on clearance. I'm kind of kicking myself because I should have basically bought every single version. That's a good one. Come here. Oh, yes. That's a good one. That's the kind of, that's the size I'm looking for, man. Heck yeah. That one got me pumped. It's been a grind. I mean, this is only the third one for the day. So we got the smallie, we had, uh, uh, the second one was largey, and now this guy, third one. Super cold fish. Super cold fish, actually. Look at this chunks there. Got a nice healthy belly on them. Yeah. All right. So maybe the afternoon bite was the right call. Glad I started it uh, a little bit later today. Man, this guy's cold. All right, buddy. I appreciate it. See you next time. I felt really good. All right, maybe we're onto something. So the bite's picking up just a little bit. And again, still flipping that jig. So I made that uh, change in, in jig color not too long ago. So that's three, uh, three in total. One more than last week. So that's already a success right there. I'm still primarily just targeting these areas where, again, you just have a lot of lay down and timber, brush piles, things like that. All right, guys, that's gonna go ahead and do it for today. So again, not the most exciting video once again, but honestly, the bite's just been tough. It's gonna be like that from here on out. I have no idea how many weeks left I have of this, but Today wasn't bad in terms of weather. In terms of numbers, I think we ended the day with three or four. So I hope you guys did enjoy that video. Again, it's sort of a quick one, but I've been uh, having a really good time, honestly, just pushing out these videos for you guys. Hopefully you've been enjoying the content. I'm trying to make some high quality videos for you guys. Uh, definitely need more fish catches, but you guys know how it goes. I mean, it's called fishing, not catching, right? If you guys have been liking the content, I do encourage you to subscribe. Hit the like button down below as well. I'll catch you guys out on the water next time. Thank you.